Hey y'all. So if you haven't heard, Tuesday morning is going through another round of closures. And sadly, the one that's closest to me, about 10 minutes away, is on that list of closing. Um, there is one near my sister, about 30 minutes away. So I won't be totally deprived of Tuesday morning. Uh, I know a lot of people were the first round of closures they did and even more so now that they're going through this second round and I hope they don't end up closing all together eventually but at the rate they're going it doesn't seem like it's too good for them but anyway I do uh, shop there for other things other than crafty items um, right now, everything in the store is 10% off. The rugs are 20% off. So if you're looking for a rug, go check them out because I got a rug and a runner for a pretty good price. So anyway, I thought I would share what I bought. All this was, you know, 10% off. So not a drastic price reduction at the moment. But I think I will go back. Uh, they said our store was slated to close at the end of March. So when they get into the deep discounts, I will go back and see if there's anything left. And Because um, then I don't mind if it's duplicates of something that I already have. If it's a uh, really, really good price. So let's just uh, show what I've purchased today. And they were already out of the bigger bags, so I just I put my little my little stuff in a bag, and then I just carry the rest out. So I'm gonna quickly go through these embellishments. This is homegrown, so it's right now it's priced at two ninety nine. So like I said, everything was ten percent off. But look here, here's another. This must have not hit the price increase. And this did. Because here's another bits and pieces. And it's $3.29. Because I know they went up on their prices some. So that one I paid $2.99. This one is was $3.29. Well, minus 10%. I picked up uh, Farmhouse Living die cuts. Oh, I could show you the back of them if you haven't seen them because this isn't really new stuff. Here is Happy Hearts and then Homegrown. I do have this uh, Homegrown paper so I picked up these chipboard stickers and this may be the second set I have of this. And then I don't have New Day, but I have a lot of Echo Park and Cartabella. So it'll go with something in uh, those with the Echo Park or Cartabella because, you know, they kind of use the same color palette. And they had a ton of these chipboards at uh, my local store and I, I didn't get them all the the ones I had I just picked up the, the ones that I was attracted to right away this is from farmhouse summer and a slice of sunshine and then I did pick up this simple stories happy hearts now, this is 12 by 12 Essentials Kit plus two additional embellishments. So, this isn't like the collection kit. And I don't know if it's the true Essentials Kit. It's got 12 sheets of paper. Let's see. Because so sometimes they have a mix of things in it. I've gotten one before that actually had a embellish a sticker sheet from a whole different collection that was Simple Stories, but it wasn't the Simple Stories collection that I bought. It was from a different Simple Stories collection, so it was kind of mixed up a little bit. Um, puffy stickers, 
and these don't seem they might have just a little bit of wrinkle on a couple of them but um, I heard they're not manufacturing these anymore because of production issues with the puffy stickers for simple stories this one is the page pieces which comes with 18 ephemera pieces this is from 2021 that's why I was looking for the date so we got the sticker sheet I'm just gonna go through this very quickly and this morning I'm off of work today I had some appointments and so I kind of had a me day and uh, I was watching Scylla this morning and she was showing well I think it was from Valentine's Day and she was showing some layouts that she made of her and her husband using Valentine product so that kind of inspired me to pick this up so thank you Scylla for enabling me so some of these sheets our duplicate so it looks like we got yeah duplicates cute cute I love this ledger paper so I'm gonna set that let me set the stuff to the side I did pick up this envelope template by die cuts with a view and I don't know maybe I don't know I don't know why I got it because I have envelope templates on the back of my scoring board but it was $3.29 and I had some simple stories card kits that we got in crop and create and I wanted to send some out for Christmas and I didn't have the right size envelope so guess what I didn't send any out so that's the purpose behind that now I did get this and I've passed it over so many times um, but I did pick it up today this lemon twist it says 12 by 12 essentials kits plus two additional embellishments, but we'll see. We'll see what's in here. It's a surprise because all you could see without opening the pack was like the solid. So, okay. So I got the chipboard stickers and the bits and pieces because I love this line, but I would find it very hard to use, but I said what the heck and oh look yeah what I thought it's just the it's just the cards it is just the card stock there's none of the papers this is yeah oh. yeah we got the yellow we got the blue and the white blue and the yellow the yellow and the black the white and the blue yeah so no pattern paper <laughs> well that one was a dud I should have opened it up in the store so we basically got the the, the colored pattern paper cardstock type and some bits and pieces and chipboard stickers and I do have a few sheets in my scrap room kit so I don't know I can probably throw some of this stuff on other pages I may <laughs> so this might be something I'd keep on my desk to see if I can incorporate into anything else womp womp 
because guess what? There are no returns. If the store is closing, all sales are final. So, uh, word to the wise, take a peek if you can. And then the last thing I picked up was this Jen Hadfield Live and Let Grow. And it was $7.49, so it was 10% off of that. And they did, I saw some Park Lane at Tuesday morning, which is um, what Joanne carries. I think they're by American Crafts. And they had a mega stack of Jen Hadfield, like different papers from her collections, but the paper was very thin. So I'm just going to do a quick flip through. I have a ton of Jen Hadfield. So I'm sure all the um, die cuts and chipboard stickers and things that I have will work with a lot of this collection. And now we're doing duplicates. So, that is what I got. I'm pretty happy except for my <laughs> lemon twist ripoff because it's not an essentials kit. So, when you see these, take a peek. <laughs> and that's it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye. Okay, so <laughs> I want to hop back on for a moment because I say to myself and others, I may have fallen off the turnip truck, but I didn't fall off of it yesterday because as I was cleaning up, I noticed I paid attention to this and not Simple Stories, not Lemon Twist, not Essentials Kit, but this. <laughs> this is what's in the packaging, duh. So, if you were laughing at me, I am laughing at myself because I figured it out. Eventually, I'll figure it out. But yes, it showed me right on the packaging that it was nothing but the uh, cardstock type pattern paper. Just as the Happy Heart showed me the papers that were in this Essentials Kit. So, yes, if you were wondering... I figured it out. So, <laughs> we'll see you next time. Bye.